guys, this is Rich here on behalf of Rich TV Live, and I'm really interested in lithium. And the question is, why standard lithium? Standard lithium's breakthrough rapid lithium extraction process reduces the recovery time of extracting lithium from brine from the current industry method that takes years to as little as several hours. So this is the reason why this company has so much potential. If you can extract the brine, the lithium from the brine in hours versus years, that is revolutionary. And with the right team, this could be a company that I believe could be a huge winner. Now take a look at the news that just broke. Standard Lithium signs joint venture term sheet with global specialty chemical company Lanxis. Standard Lithium, SLL on the Toronto Stock Venture Exchange, and the symbol STLHF on the OTCQX Exchange, the highest tier in America, and in Frankfurt under the symbol S5L, announces it has signed a term sheet with global specialty chemical company Lanxis Corporation for a contemplated joint venture in the commercial production of battery grade lithium for brine extracted from the Smackover Formation in southern Arkansas. Now, Smackover is known, I've been doing a lot of research on standard lithium, and Smackover is known for having huge amount of lithium, okay? Standard Lithium is working with Lanxis in a phased approach as per terms of a binding memorandum of understanding to develop commercial opportunities related to the production, marketing, and sale of battery-grade lithium products extracted from brine product produced from the smack over formation. Once again, a property and area that is known for huge amount of lithium deposits. Now, Let's just take a look at the stock. This is a stock that has come down from much higher levels, all right? We're going to mark this. So let's put a heart right here. We'll just say right here. So we were at $1.96 in February. We've been as low as the low low is $0.61. Cents. So when I'm marking a stock, what I like to do is I want to be able to mark the low low and I want to mark the high high. So we're going to use the heart again. Let's use the heart. And we're going to mark the low low here. And the low low is 61 cents. So obviously, if you can get in at 61 cents, that is a great price. I'm looking at the American one right now, STLHF, which is currently at 96 cents. It was down 4% today on this big news. 60 cents is the price you would like to buy it at, okay? Now remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for education and entertainment purposes. Always do your due diligence, always do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here on Rich TV Live. Get all the breaking news, all the top stock information, anything to know with cryptocurrencies. If you wanna contact us and you wanna join our group, you can join our secret stock picks group, absolutely free. Hover over contact right there, join our Slack, Discord, YouTube, Instagram, our podcast, Facebook, LinkedIn, all of our social media platforms, absolutely free. Over 60,000 members and growing globally. It's true. And it's because we're finding the winners and we find them first. We find them before they explode. We identify them and we try to explain why they're going to explode. And it could be because of the team. Now, Standard Lithium is powering the future. Standard Lithium's management and scientific technical board have the ideal blend of business skills and technical experience required to implement and execute on the company's disciplined business plan. Standard Lithium CEO Robert Mintak and President COO Dr. Andrew Robinson has significant experience in lithium project development. Mr. Mintak has a global network of industry contacts and has been active in the sector for the past decade. Dr. Robinson is a PhD geochemist with 20 plus years of project development experience. Dr. Robinson has worked on a wide variety of energy, resource, and water projects globally. Non-executive chairman Robert Cross is an engineer 
with 25 years of experience as a financier and company builder. And Robert Cross is huge in this industry and serves as chairman of B2 Gold, a huge company. He was also co-founder and chairman of Bankers Petroleum Limited. Mr. Cross has an engineering degree from the University of Waterloo and an MBA from Harvard University. Wow. Unbelievable. Standard Lithium has established a world-class scientific advisory council of scientists and process engineers with decades of experience. The company's breakthrough rapid lithium extraction process reduces the recovery time of extracting lithium from brine from the current industry method that takes years to as little as several hours. This is what's making this company so tantalizing for me. Much more environmentally friendly with a significantly smaller footprint than the conventional processes. The company has a signed agreement to locate a demonstration scale plant of its rapid lithium extraction process in Southern Arkansas in 2019. Focus on projection execution. Standard Lithium is focusing on projects where production can be brought online quickly, where possible, and company is partnering with active US-based permitted brine producers and is utilizing a mix of conventional and new lithium extraction technologies based on project requirements. I'm telling you guys, put this on your watch list, put it on your radar, they just keep putting out news. All great things are happening right now with this company. They have a very strong team of winners that have done it before and they will do it again. This is what you need to do. You need to follow the money. Look, we are closer to the bottom than we are at the top, okay? I believe from these levels, we could see a 100% increase. With lithium being hot and Tesla being so hot, I believe this is an industry that could explode. Now, let's get back to this news. Under the proposed terms of the joint venture, Lanxis would contribute lithium extraction rights and grant access to its existing infrastructure to the joint venture. And Standard Lithium would contribute existing rights and leases held in the smackover formation and the pilot plant being developed on the property as well as its proprietary extraction processes including all relevant intellectual property rights. Upon proof of concept, Lanxis is prepared to provide funding to the joint venture to allow commercial development of the future project, commercial project. And it is anticipated that the joint venture will include options for Standard Lithium to participate in project funding on similar terms. This is great. This is huge news for Standard Lithium. The final terms of the joint venture and any funding arrangement remain subject to completion of due diligence technical proof of concept, normal economic viable studies, preliminary feasibility study to confirm the technical feasibility and economic viability of the project and the negotiation of definitive agreements between the parties. This could be the break that they've been looking for. This is huge. Let's just learn a little bit more about Standard Lithium. The company's flagship Lanxis project is located in Southern Arkansas, where it is engaged in the testing and proving of the commercial viability of lithium extraction from over 150,000 acres of permitted brine operations utilizing the company's proprietary selective extraction technology. The company is also pursuing the resource development of over 30,000 acres of separate brine leases located in Southern Arkansas and approximately 45,000 acres of mineral leases located in Moab Desert in San Bernito County, California. Wow, this is incredible. Investors are cautioned that without a pre-feasibility or feasibility study prepared in accordance with NI 43101, there can be no assurance that the term sheet will result in an actual producing lithium mine. So there is the disclaimer right there. Now, like I said, do your own research, do your own due diligence. This is the news. It's just a joint venture term sheet. However, once this gets signed, this can open up doors and money for this company to explode. And this is why you need to put it on your watch list, put it on your radar, and you're talking about a company that is able to extract lithium in hours versus years. Just think about it. Who broke it down?
Who made you understand? Your boy Rich. It's true. And we did it all for free. We don't want your money. We want your eyes and ears on the prize. That's what we want. We want your eyes and ears on the prize. Let's take a look at the team. We talked about them a little bit. Maybe you could take a look at them. A unique company. Let's just read this real quick. A unique company for a unique opportunity. Technology is reshaping our approach to mining, putting large resources that were once inaccessible or overlooked within immediate reach. I love this. Absolutely love this. And by applying a disciplined development plan, proprietary rapid lithium processing technology and strategic alliances, Standard Lithium is positioning itself to lead the next generation of lithium producers. This could be the team. There it is. Robert Mintak, the CEO. Dr. Andy Robinson, the COO. We were talking about them earlier. This is the dream team. And right there, there is Robert Cross. So we spoke about some of these people before. This is the technical team and scientific advisors. What do you guys think? If you like this video, smash the like button. Comment down below. What do you think about this big news? Standard Lithium. Changing the game. This is revolutionary. Do you think that this is going to be a big winner? Comment down below. Let me know what you think about the joint venture term sheet with global specialty chemical company, Lanxis. Big news. We broke it to you first. Holler at your boy. If you're not winning, you're not watching, we bring you the winners and we bring them to you first. Standard Lithium, SLL in Canada, STLHF in America, and S5L in Frankfurt. Could it be a big winner? I think so. I think we could see it go up at least 100% in the future, if not more. And with this technology, I wouldn't even be surprised if it goes up 10 times. In fact, let's take a look at the share structure before we leave. I'm going to show you something. The reason why I really, really, really like this company. That it's an OTCQX company. Love OTCQX companies. Those are the highest tier of companies. And bam, 74 million shares issued outstanding. That is super tight. So they have very little volume, tight amount of shares. This seems to me like the type of company that could explode at any moment. So I, I don't own any. I'm not saying you should buy some. But if you do, please let me know. I would like to know if you like this company, if you're buying it, if you are, what price. You know, I, I showed you guys earlier, the bottom is around 60 cents. If you can get it at that price, you're buying literally gold. Um, if you can even get it at 90 cents, I think that we could see a double. We've seen it at $2. It's right now 96 cents. I think that we could see a 100% increase here based on some of the big news that's coming out for this company that we've been looking at. And I believe that they have a great future, a strong management team, good share structure, a great product that's hot right now that people are talking about. Yeah, I think you can book it. I think this is something that can go up at least 100%, maybe even 1,000% in the future. And you heard it here first from your boy, Rich. It's true. Thank you for watching. I'm out. Peace. Standard Lithium, leading the next wave of lithium production. Southern Arkansas smackover formation.